that 3D printers have been running nonstop at SeaTech High School in Fresno, California. The equipment, normally used by students as part of the manufacturing curriculum at this career technical education charter school, is being pressed into action for a higher purpose. We are making uh, face shields uh, to help local hospitals deal with uh, contaminant issues for COVID-19. There is not only a shortage of this kind of protective gear for hospital staff in the Central Valley, but worldwide. Fresno County Superintendent of Schools Jim Yavino said when he was sent a drawing of a face shield, he didn't hesitate to act. I quickly sent that over to our engineers over at SeaTech, and and of course they uh, started redesigning it a little bit um, because as we decide as we started to make them, we realized some of the products aren't available uh, because everyone's buying up elastic bands right now. Brian Emerson, who teaches manufacturing at SeaTech, is an engineer by trade and was able to modify the design. Normally the connectors in the back were meant to have elastic straps go over it. So we modified it for bungee cord because we could get a lot of that and just started producing it. This job, which includes printing the headband, cleaning and sanding it, attaching the bungee strap, this work would normally be done by students. But the shutdown of schools has them contributing from home. Here, you can share it with me. The staff doing the hands-on work. It's a great opportunity for our staff and, um, and for us to involve kids when we can at home to be involved in the same process that we would be doing as if they were here today. SeaTech staff members, including director John Delano, are working in shifts and rotations around the clock. Their goal was to produce 500 of these face shields for local hospital staff, but that was before others got involved. There's, a, there's going to be a great story when all this is over. It's kind of exploding now through the schools. We're asking other uh, schools who have 3D printers uh, if they would uh, help start printing masks. We've got our business leaders in the community who are asking how they can help. SeaTech has been able to deliver its first shipment of face shields to UCSF medical staff at Community Regional Medical Center. I was shocked. I'm so we are so thrilled to have the donation from SeaTech of the face masks. We this is something that we've been needing. We're really thrilled to feel the support of SeaTech and the community. To to have a situation like COVID-19 affect our community, but we rally around each other to make a, a, an impact on on our community is outstanding, amazing. I'm just glad to be a part of it. Right now, the staff here at SeaTech is printing about 50 face shields a day. But now that other schools and businesses are involved, that number will go up. And they say none too soon. For the Office of the Fresno County Superintendent of Schools, I'm Juanita Stevenson.